Yes, yeah, so are you ready? Yes. Anastasia, are you ready? Yes. Let's look at the wall. Did you know you the same show as Meghan Markle? I know, that's crazy. My sister's Mercedes and Anastasia Corner. The sisters are young entrepreneurs. That connection between parents and kids. Creating a community. Hi guys, welcome back to Small Bits of Happiness YouTube. Today we're gonna to be sharing with you five tips to help you stay more organized. Going. It's going well, I guess. Good workout. This is the best arm workout I've ever had. Oh. Hold on. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> This is packing up to go to the mall. Time check. Yeah. Oh, um, 8.30. It's 8.30 right now. We are packing up. We got the spinner. We got Teresa, Gwyneth, and what's the last girl's name? Um, Stephanie. Okay. boxes because the next part of shop bits is jewelry to inspire you to look for the happiness in every day this is the new jewelry you open it up and it has a little butterfly just to inspire you to look for the happiness in nature As they navigate through the stresses that comes with being one. Some young entrepreneurs want to change just that. Mercedes and Anastasia Corga, good morning. Thank you so much for being here this morning. Thank you. Why did you come up with this business plan, this idea to make a business out of happiness? Yeah, well, we're both teenagers, so we know how difficult it can be to feel happy sometimes. I mean, as teenagers, we have changing hormones, friendship issues, school is getting tougher. On top of all that, we have post-pandemic life climate change war, all these added stressors, they make it hard to feel happy sometimes. We started Small Bits of Happiness in the midst of the pandemic. We were both kind of on the brink of teenagehood and we were stressed out. We were feeling a bit sad and unhappy. And I think a lot of our peers and friends could relate. So we started looking for the small things, the small good things that happen every day, like going for a walk with the dog, eating some chocolate, watching the sunrise or the sunset. And we felt so much happier that we wanted to start to share that with others because we know that everyone can use a little bit of more happiness in their life. So we started on social media, you know. We also created a website. And under there, we have a blog called Bits, where we interview Olympic athletes, teen celebrities, body image experts, and more. All the content we post is all based off of things that have helped us feel happier and that have helped people we know feel happier. We've spoken to tons of teens and parents and moms, and we just want to share that. They've also created a game to teach teens and their parents how to make daily happiness intentional. This is really something for everyone. Anyone could truly benefit. That's why we designed um, Mission Small Bits of Happiness, because honestly, everybody could use a little bit more happiness right and so it has 100 unique things you can do every day to feel happier so you do one card a day to build happiness habits and learn what makes you feel happier and it's really a spectacular game 
We've had moms just come to absolute tears by the opportunity it gives for them to build happiness habits hmm. and to give their children a tool to connect with their kids and help their kids find more happiness in every day. That's part of our mission. We just want to make everyone feel happier and find happiness in their day. Inspiring teens around the world to control their own small bits of happiness. That's amazing. I think you guys are definitely succeeding. This is awesome. And they're not done spreading happiness. Start a happiness podcast.